Right, hello, uh, welcome to uh, another Sculpture Battle Report. So, bit of an impromptu, well it's not an impromptu game, we know, knew we were going to play, but we're both unprepared. So, we have simple Purge the Alien on Dawn of War deployment, Orcs versus Chaos. We'll start down here, Orc Battle Wagon, with uh, some units in it, some Orcs in it. That's actually a truck, some Death Copters, a Looted Wagon. Which is, I think it's the first time I'm playing a looted wagon, I'm just trying it out. Some looters, a big mech with a shock attack gun. I'm going for comedy this game rather than effectiveness, I doubt I'll win. Some looters here, some more death copters, and another truck. My warlord is actually old Zogwart today, but Zogwart hasn't got a model, so I'm going to be using Snickrot to model rep for Zogwart. But he's in a truck over there somewhere. Also for Chaos, we have only on the board for Chaos at the beginning of the game is a bunch of rhinos. Orcs won initiative. They decided to, to deploy first and Chaos have only put rhinos on the table and they've infiltrated. So that's going to be interesting. I have no idea what's in them. So we'll see what's coming up. Okay, so end of Orc turn one. Quite a good start for the Orcs. They got. Uh, I also rolled my Warlord trait, which was completely bloody useless. It was something to do with objectives, and because we got Purge the Alien uh, in our game type, there are no objectives other than killing each other. So, Orc turn one, we had forward movement, the battle wagon, and the uh, truck moved up here. The loot wagon moved up. These looters didn't move. These looters didn't move, that truck moved forward behind that building there. However, first of all, this squad of death copters moved along here, opened fired on the rhino up here, and got one glancing hit and three penetrating hits on the rear armour, blew it up completely, and out tumbled a bunch of chaos. What are these? The Havocs. Havocs. The Havocs came out and lost, I think, two guys in the explosion. Then these Death Copters fired on the back of this Rhino here and immobilised it. I'm um, not sure if it's blown. No, it's just immobilised. And, oh, and it lost a weapon as well, yeah. And then the big mech moved up into this building, fired his shock attack gun down here, and he hit... A double six, which is Ra, which opened up a demonic tunnel and caused a penetrating hit on that rhino there, which has caused a crew shaking. And that was it for Orc Turn 1. And we're back with uh, the end of Chaos Turn 1. And quite a good, uh, it was a good start for Orcs on Turn 1, and it was also a very good start for Chaos. We had... The Havocs that came out of the destroyed Rhino fired down at the Death Copters that destroyed their transport and caused one wound on one of them. <laughs> then, over here, these Noise Marines, Huron, and who are the guys in Huron? Are they just normal Chaos Marines? Yep. Yeah, Chaos Marines, Huron, and Noise Marines piled out. Completely destroyed uh, one unit of Death Copters that was there. That was one unit destroyed, one point, and first blood. So that's two points to chaos. And then the noise marines open fire on the squad of looters over there. There were ten looters there. You'll notice there are no looters there now. So that's another point to chaos. And then they fired this uh, rhino, sorry, fired down onto the truck that's over there and destroyed the truck. It went out of control, hit a wall. And three mega knobs fell out, and one of them actually took a wound on a really bad dice roll from the explosion. So, three points to Chaos at the end of Chaos Turn 1. And we'll be back with Orc Turn 2. Rolling for reserve sucks. No roll for reserves again? No. <laughs> okay. There you go. <laughs> Doesn't count. Uh, end of Orc Turn 2. And what happened in Orc Turn 2? That truck moved up, and nothing happened with that truck because it's got no line of sight. That battle wagon moved around the corner, it opened fire with some uh, big shooters and a zap gun 
on the Havocs here, and I don't think it did anything at all. The Death Copters moved forward and shot on the same Havocs. I think I killed maybe two of those, one or two of those of the Havocs. I can't remember. One inch. One inch. Each squad. One from each squad. Okay. Um, the Big Mech didn't fire because I forgot that he's got an Ordnance weapon, so he shouldn't have actually moved and fired last turn, so I forgo my... Uh, shooting phase for him this turn because that would have been a bit unfair so we assumed that he moved this turn whatever a bit naughty but never mind uh the mega knobs charged in to that rhino and destroyed it it didn't blow up thankfully and then the looted wagon fired its boom gun centered on huron took out three noise marines and a couple of normal marines and uh, didn't hurt huron because huron it is an asshole. And that is, oh, and the looters ran away behind that building over there to try and get line of sight down here. So that's the end of Orc Turn 2, stepping over the cat. And we'll be back. Right, that was Chaos Turn 2. Where to start? Okay, so Huron got, what was it? Scryer's Gaze. Scryer's Gaze allowed him to roll 3d6 and choose the uh, option that he wants when rolling for outflank, reserves, etc. So, obviously, Chaos decided to bring on the... What's it called? Big flying bird thing. I can't remember what the bloody thing's called for some reason. Heldrake. Heldrake, thank you. The Heldrake came in, flew over the big... Uh, the Mega Knobs, rather, that were attacking the Rhinos here set fire to them and then flew off. Um, oh, it also attacked them as it flew over with a vector strike. Then the remaining Chaos Marines, Huron, uh, fired upon the Mega Knobs, killed two. This group of Chaos Marines disembarked from that Rhino. Are these Chaos Marines that disembarked this round? Mm. Those are Chaos Marines, yes? Normal ones, yeah. Yeah, they disembarked and they opened fire on the Mega Knobs as well. It was taken out to one Mega Knob remaining, who ran away. He's lost a wound and he's on fire because of Hellblaze from the flying birdie you thing. So his name I've forgotten already. Uh, you need to roll for it. Yeah, start next turn. Over here, these guys, the Havocs and Devastators, I believe they're called. Well, that might just be normal Marines. Fired down and destroyed the head Death Copters. The Noise Marines here. Fired up into that building there and killed the big mech. I believe that's everything. Uh, so, so far we are at a total of four points to Chaos and no points to the Orcs at all so far. But we're going to go into Orc turn three and see if we can get some revenge. Okay, that was Orc turn three. The Battle Wagon opened fire on the Heldrake, I remember what it's called now. The battle wagon's big shooters cannot hurt the Heldrake, so it fired with a zap gun and missed horribly. The truck here and the boys inside fired upon the Havocs and killed one. The loot wagon fired, rolled a one at the beginning of its movement turn, which means it got, uh, gets the don't press that rule, so it had to, rule, uh, roll, had to move forwards. It then opened fire on the Heldrake, got a direct hit, but didn't do any damage. The looters scuttled out from behind the building, opened fire down here onto the noise marines and killed one noise marine. Whoopee, hawks, hawks, hawks are not doing very well at all this game. Mega Knob is still running away and is still on fire. That is denoted by the little chaos flag stood next to him, showing that he's on fire. So that was Orc turn three, still no points scored for Orcs. Things not going well at all. And we're back with the end of Chaos Turn 3. And as if the battle wasn't going badly enough for Orcs before this, this is kind of sealing the deal. So what did we have? We had the Helldrake flew down here. The noise marines over here fired down on the looters that were here, killed seven of them. 
the Helldrake then use its Bale Flamer to kill the last remaining three. Those Devastators, I believe they are, moved in over there behind cover. Those Havocs are moving up here to take cover behind the destroyed Rhino. These Chaos Marines moved forward and killed the last fleeing Meganob. So that in total is another destroyed unit. That's where the Meganob used to be. And that's where the Looters used to be. So that's another destroyed unit. That's another two points to Chaos. Chaos on six points versus Orcs on no points at all so far this game. So we're going to go into Orc turn four and see if Orcs can pull anything back. Alrighty, and that was the end of Orc turn four. I'm really playing badly today. I'm completely forgetting, forgetting what I'm doing. I wasn't prepared for this battle, but never mind. Uh, the looted wagon did not get a don't press that, so it didn't move forward. Zogwart and his boys disembarked from the looted wagon and jumped over here. However, before that happened, Zogwart rolled a frazzle and had line of sight on Huron. So he fired the shot at Huron and took Huron's wound down by one. The looted wagon then fired on Huron and took a wound off him as well. That truck moved up and then moved flat out. That battle wagon fired down here and took out one Marine. So not a lot happening still for the Orcs. It does look like Chaos have got this in the bag. However, there are still Orcs inside each of these vehicles, which I completely forgot to pull out of them because I'm not paying attention. So hopefully at the end of next turn, the Orcs should be able to pull something back if I start concentrating on the actual game. However, it is turn four. We're going to Chaos turn four, so we'll see where the game goes. Right, end of Chaos, turn four, and a combination of me playing horribly badly and Chaos playing extremely well and also the Dice Gods loving Chaos tonight, Orcs are failing horribly. So, pretty much everything over here opened fire inside this building through various doors and openings down onto Zogwart's unit, which was here. And now there's just a big mass here. You imagine there's a mess of smouldering fungus and one fleeing Zogwart who is still on fire because the Helldrake Hello. set fire to Zogwart with the Bale Flamer. So he's on fire, he's down to one wound, and he's fleeing. Chaos moving up. They've got full control of this end of the battlefield. Orcs have got very little they can do at this point. That truck still has some orcs in it. That battle wagon still has some orcs in it. And there's a looted wagon there which still can do something. But at the moment, we're looking at about eight points once Zogwart's dead and nothing to orcs. So we're going on to a turn five and see if I can save any face at all from this battle. And that was orc turn five. Zogwart, still running away. The flames from Soul Blaze, from the uh, Battle Turkey, have gone out, thank God. He's still running, didn't make a heroic save, and uh, has just run in front of the Battle Turkey, so he's probably going to get set fire to any moment. Looted Wagon opened fire down onto Huron over there, took another wound off Huron, killed one of the Chaos Marines in front of him. Orc boys piled out of this truck, charged towards a squad of Havoc Marines, not Devastator Marines. I apologize to all Chaos players for actually calling them Devastator Marines, they're Havoc Marines. And they killed a unit of Havoc Marines. Finally, a point to Orcs. The Battle Wagon opened fire on the second squad of Havoc Marines that was here, killed two, I believe, and then the third failed his morale and is now running away. So one point from that turn to Orcs. So we're looking at, I believe, 6-1 to Orcs, uh, sorry, to Chaos at the moment. Uh, I don't really think I can turn this game around, but at least I've scored a point. We'll see what happens at the end of turn five. I'm in the grim dark future with a... <laughs> 
like ceramite armor and shit to like power armor, but it's like. I'm assuming they must have some sort of catheter. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, yeah and so. <laughs> going to pants. <laughs> That's the. <laughs> Oh, okay, I'm leaving this in. This isn't getting edited. Uh, how do you go to the toilet in Power Armor? Anyway, end of Chaos Turn 5, and with variable, variable game length, we rolled a 1, so that is the end of the game. And this is a game which teaches the importance of actually thinking about your army list and not putting it together five minutes before your opponent turns up. Because I have been well and truly whipped. Nine points to one to Chaos. Uh, end of Chaos turn 5, if you remember there was that unit there of orcs that had come out of this truck and killed one unit, that guy was the last guy of his unit and he actually rallied heroically and turned around and fired on them. Everybody else, pretty much everybody in the Chaos army over here fired on that one unit of orc shooter boys and killed it, scoring another point. However. End of Orc turn 5, Zogwart was here on fire running away and the Helldrake killed him. So that was another point for a unit destroyed and another point for Warlord Slayer. So end of the game, 9 points plays 1 point to Chaos. Good game. See you next time when hopefully I will save you.